how is that different than just like a non-native, like an animal that maybe we are okay with having? No, that's a really good question. So the difference is, is that the native species that live here have adapted to specifically live in these eco regions. Mm -hmm. And uh, usually those adaptations happen over thousands, hundreds of thousands for some of our species, even millions of years Mm -hmm. versus these invasive species have adaptations, but they were originally in an eco region that wasn't here. Mm -hmm. So for some of these species, they're South American natives. But the thing is, unfortunately, fortunately, unfortunately, the adaptations that they develop in, you know, say South America, the living space can be kind of similar. It can be a river space. It can be that kind of humid, dense vegetation kind of vibe. And so when they are transplanted, usually again through through human interference, they find themselves in an eco region that is not the same, but kind of has similar properties, right? Is, Mm -hmm. you know, also maybe river based is also humid is also you know some dense vegetation lots of plant life and so they find themselves in a situation where they can thrive Mm -hmm. too even when they're not in their native space and the big issue is that when they do thrive so well they knock out the animals that lived in that space originally